Remaining by my side are a small, tight-knit group of the most elite journalists in the world. Exposing corruption requires standing up to power because power hates sunlight. We are sunlight. I just want James O'Keefe to live his dream. And that does not include anything having to do with news or politics. I just want him to dance, RM. I just want him to dance. Just He's go gotta for it. dance. Go just for it. And embrace it. Put on those uh <laughs> outfits, those leather pants and all that. Go for it. What are you doing? Yes. You're clear you he's got it, you know? He does have it. No, no, no. But seriously, <laughs> I yeah. I personally have genuinely, I'm not this is not an exaggeration. I have enjoyed his performances. Okay, and I'm not talking about the Project Veritas garbage. I'm talking <laughs> about you guys know what I'm talking about. You guys know what I'm talking about. No, I'm gonna skip oh, yeah. ahead. I'm gonna skip ahead to oligarchy. Sorry. This this is perfect. I just can't believe. James O'Keefe is suing Twitter for defamation. I think the project is being taken down because they confronted a Facebook executive. If a video like that down, that would be due to a doxing concern. I can show you a video of CNN doing the exact same thing. Twitter made factual statements about our client that are false. No, come on, come on, come on, wow. come on. Just do that. Just do that. You know what? I'll pay for your Patreon. I'll be a member if that's all you do. I'll be a patron. Yeah, I'll be a patron too. Yeah. If I come could, on. If I could hear. If I could hear more of those synth riffs and mm. those, see him doing those spins and see the Project Veritas dancers. Oh my God! I'll why, put five dollars a month. Why does everyone in the country have to be punished by right wing men who wanted to make it in the entertainment industry failed and decided to again punish all of us with their political stuff? Just Absolutely. walk away from Absolutely. there. The internet can make anyone a star. Right? So ignore the entertainment establishment and pave your own way, James. Pave your own way. I will support you if, if you step away from the news and politics and just focus <laughs> on the dancing and performing. Because I believe in you. I believe in him. Okay? I think that he is fun to watch. If he keeps doing doing those heel spins, I'm I'm gonna be a supporter too. I'm in. I'm in. Let's go, James. I love it. I love it so much. Okay, so let's actually, I guess, do the story. Uh, what is this? What's going on? Well, he uh, was ousted from Project Veritas. Uh, we've been covering this hard hitting story from the very beginning. And it was because of like what he was spending Project Veritas's funds on. We'll give you a refresher on that. But um, <laughs> let's take that video again from the top. The, the very first video we showed you, oligarchy we could put off to the side for now. This time we'll show you the weird beginning of the video where O'Keefe takes uh, one bite of a Subway sandwich for some reason and then throws it away. Uh, and a one and a two and a three, let's do it. I spent 14 years creating the most effective nonprofit newsroom this country has ever seen. And in paving the way to establish citizen journalism, I have been defamed, arrested, raided, and ultimately removed from the organization I spent so much time developing credibility of. I always knew they would try to ruin the reputations of those who expose them, the pharma giants, the three letter government agencies, and those who I thought I could trust. But in response, we are going to build an army of investigators and exposers. They have awakened a sleeping giant, I'm back. Remaining by my side are a small, tight knit group of the most elite journalists in the world. Exposing corruption requires standing up to power because power hates sunlight. We are sunlight. But 
but why are you dancing? <laughs> <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Like he wants yeah. to dance, but it doesn't work with what you're trying to do. So just get rid of the politics, get rid of the news and just dance. That's that's all I'm saying. And I don't like what happened with the Subway sandwich? Why? How did that happen? And why did that happen? Is Subway a sponsor? Like I don't get it. I don't know, but I I'm I'm into it. Whatever the whatever this is, which is hard to discern, I am into it. I love his when he's like, "I'm back. I'm back." Thank God. I, Thank God. You know, when he said that, I was like, "Oh no!" You know, it's uh, you know, he's and he's uh, and he's un he's unbearably cool too. Let's be honest. No. Like when when they do that when they do that close up, you're like, "This <laughs> does not look like a grown up, uh, like a tenth grader. This is a cool guy." You know, this is a you can a, a <laughs> you can tell he grew up loving Michael Jackson performances. Because a yeah, lot of his dance yeah. moves are Michael Jackson esque, and he's Absolutely. like, I just want to be on that stage, bro. I just want to be one of the backup dancers. Like he just, you could tell he wants to be a performer. So just be a performer, but like not the kind of performer that you were at Project Veritas. Again, like I, I see nothing objectionable about him just dancing and having a good time. <laughs> I want to like really Absolutely. positively reinforce that. You get what I'm saying? Like just go absolutely. For it. You, every office that I've ever worked in. There's always like, uh, you know, there's always a guy who's like, I'm just doing this now until my break dancing career or my whatever career pops off. And he's a guy with this like far right media platform who I think thinks about all day. I'm gonna do this for a while until my Michael Jackson moves start to become in the, you know, in the forefront. You know, it's uh, I'm with you. Just do just do the dancing. Just do the, do dan the put dancing. Up some, exactly. Do the dancing. And yeah. by the way, I have no doubt that there's plenty of people that you can fundraise off of by being honest and just telling them, I want to use your money to make music videos. I guarantee you there will be a base of supporters that will fund that. Um, but here's what got him ousted at Project Veritas. He wanted to use funding for his like dancing and music videos, but apparently they didn't like that. Now the Project Veritas board <laughs> uh, accused O'Keefe of wasting $60,000 <laughs> 60, on dance events, which sounds freaking awesome. Like I wish I wish TYT would waste $60,000 on dance events. I wouldn't oust oh anyone for doing that. Um, oh, that'd be amazing. O'Keefe, a former high school musical theater performer, has been accused in the past of spending the nonprofit's money on his own musical interests. In December, Project Veritas acknowledged improperly giving O'Keefe $20,500 in excess benefits to pay for Project Veritas staff to accompany him to Virginia as he performed a lead role in a production of the musical Oklahoma. Oh, and hell yeah. And finally, here's a Project Veritas memo on O'Keefe. All the theater stuff and how that is handled makes me very uneasy. In the end, we are in a deficit now. Our fans and potential fans beyond do not respond positively to all of that stuff. I disagree. Or more importantly, maybe you guys needed new fans. If uh, mm. James O'Keefe goes in this direction, he might get those new fans, but he's got to drop the politics. That's all I'm saying. So go for it, James. I've got your back. <laughs> I've got your back. I will play every single one of those music videos on this show. I will. I'm not even kidding. Sorry, guys, but I'm telling oh, you the truth. Yeah. I enjoy it. <laughs> I enjoy it. Yeah. I, I I wonder if there's like on the cutting room floor of some of these ambush <laughs> interviews, him like at a Planned Parenthood or something. He's like. What, what, why are you killing babies? You know, he's like doing all that. And you know, maybe they had to cut a lot of that out, you know? What I want to know is how often is he dancing with himself at home? Oh, oh, oh my God, constant. constant. It's constant. He's a big yeah. dancer with her, with himself, -er, for sure. <laughs> I have no doubt. All day, every that, day. That, ro that Robin song is just on a loop in his house, for sure. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> So good. Anyway, uh, the newer video that we showed you where he's randomly dancing um, is to, I guess, promote some new media venture he's doing, which I actually have no interest in promoting. But it's freaking pricey, man. <laughs> it's pricey. Like, I really want a subscription to Financial Times 
but it's steep. So I mm. just find a way to get past their paywall. Um, in this case, though, with his uh, subscription only media venture, uh, $200 for <laughs> one year if you uh, do the early bird subscription or twenty, almost $20 a month. Um, you can also do uh, the member plans for just the low, low price of $500. You're at the bronze level, okay? You got the silver level at a thousand. The most expensive is five thousand dollars. That's one year early bird subscription. Signed, Jeez, James. I know, right? Oh my God. Signed founding member certificate. Sponsor undercover equipment. Sponsor a camera for O'Keefe. Media group undercover and journalist. Uh, behind the scenes access. I bet there is. And then personal <laughs> video from James O'Keefe. <laughs> for just a lower price of five thousand dollars, Jesus, it's anyway, a deal. It's a lot of bones. It's a lot of bones. It's, it's a lot of bones, but uh, you know, with those moves, I think it's worth it. You know what I mean? Thanks for watching the Young Turks. I really appreciate it. Another way to show support is through YouTube memberships. You'll get to interact with us more. There's live chat emojis, badges. You've got emojis of me, Anna, John, Jr. So those are super fun. But you also get playback of our exclusive member only shows and specials right after they air. So all of that, all you gotta do is click that join button right underneath the video, thank you.